The Golden Axe. Long ago, there was a child named Chen Shi. His family was very poor. He often earned money working for the landlord. Chen Shi did so many things from dawn till dusk, but the landlord still scolded him all the time. One day, he went up the mountain to chop wood. He dropped his axe into the river by accident. The river was so deep that he couldn't find it. How can I chop wood without an axe? If I return without wood, the landlord will scold me. <laughs> Young man, why are you crying? Chen Shi told the old man about the axe. Don't cry. I will go get it for you.、Huh? The old man jumped into the river and brought out a golden axe. Is this the one you lost, young man? Thank you, sir, but this is not my axe. The old man jumped into the river again and brought out a silver axe. Is this the one you lost, young man? Thank you, sir, but this is also not my axe. Once again, the man jumped into the river, and this time gave Chen Shi a black iron axe. Is this one yours, young man? Ah, thank you, sir. You are such an honest young man. I like honest children. So Chen Shi chopped wood with the iron axe, which was strangely sharp and quick to chop with. The landlord scolded him for returning early. Chen Shi told him the story of the axe, that he didn't want the golden or silver axes, and preferred to take the black iron axe. The landlord was angry and called him a fool. The next morning, he pretended to be a poor man. He took an old axe and went to the river. He threw the axe into the river and began to cry. <laughs> I dropped the axe into the river. <laughs> the old man jumped into the river and brought back up the old axe. Not this one. This isn't it. He jumped back in and brought out a silver one. The silver is good, but I prefer a gold one. The old man left the silver one on the ground, jumped back in, and brought out a gold one. <laughs> a golden axe! Yes, yes, a golden one! He grabbed the golden axe from the old man and took the silver one on the ground. With an axe in each hand, he smiled crazily. <laughs> the old man disappeared in a flash. <laughs> the landlord danced and jumped with his axes, but then tripped and fell into the river. Chen Shi returned to his home with the iron axe. He could sell wood every day and provide a good life for his family.